What's up guys, X-Wing Sports here, and I'm really excited to tell you guys that I have gotten the 200 sub mark, and it's all thanks to you. Anyways, enough of that, let's get to the video. And by the way guys, I will be going to the Miami game and uh, possibly doing a little live stream while I'm there. I don't have a really good seat, you know, I'm kind of in the end zone, but uh, maybe I can get a few shots, probably not. You know, I bring my camera, but I'm, I, don't, I definitely don't have a, a big enough zoom, like a telephoto zoom, date zoom from where I'm at, you know, where my seats are, you know. And, you know, I will be making a hate video for you, so you know, you can just go ahead and get all now back out of there. You know, go back. Ugh. Freaking hurricanes, man. So let's get to the breakdown. We do got John Mechie. Um, you remember him from last year. He was a freaking baller. I mean, he was just killing it out there. Um, making insane catches, I will say. And then we got a new guy, um, Jamison Williams. I do believe he was a... Um, he's going to be starting, I believe. Um, he came from Ohio State. He's a very speedy wide receiver from Ohio State. I think he's going to be pretty good for us. Um, then we got Slay Bolton. Um, very fast white guy. He had his first touchdown last year, late in the, uh, actually in the national championship game uh, against Ohio State. Those are our three starting wide receivers. I'm going to go ahead and say that, you know, you will see probably Christian Leary or Trayson Holden and probably even uh, IG Hall. He killed it in the um, spring game, so we'll see. Then we got Evan Neal for um, our left tackle. He's a big, big dude. Um, then we got um, then we got center position is going to be Chris Owens, and then we got uh, Neil Ekior for our right guard. Then we got um, Kendall Randolph as our right tackle. Um, a lot of these guys are new. Um, I know Kendall Randolph. I don't think I've heard of him. I don't think he, he didn't, definitely didn't start last year. Then we got Jaleel Billingsley, which will probably be um, <clears throat> the probably the best, one of the best top five best tight ends in college football this year, without a doubt. Uh, then we got Bryce Young as our quarterback. Um, back up to uh, second uh, string would probably be Paul Tyson. And uh, Jalen Milrow at third string. Um, then we got Brian Robinson Jr. Uh, definitely um, controlling the backfield. Uh, probably be the get the most carries, and then probably Chase McClellan will be second. Um, Trey Sanders actually got pretty low down uh, on this step chart. I'm looking for the number four string. So I don't know. I was hoping Trey Sanders would be up there, but. Uh, Jason McClellan. So that, that pretty much do it for the offense. Um, on defense, we have LeBron Ray as our defensive end. And um, then we got Mathis um, on the other side. Then we got DJ Dale as the tackle. Um, Will Anderson in the jack position. Um, Christian Harris in the wheel linebacker. We got uh, Henry Toto in the Mike middle linebacker role. And then we got Christopher Allen as our Sam linebacker. Um, this is a stacked linebacker group, I will say. This is just going to, our defense is probably going to be top 10, top five, probably. Um, this is going to be an insane defense. Um, uh, so experienced. Um, we got cornerback Josh Job and um, free safety DeMarco Hellums. We got uh, our safety Jordan Battle and our other quarterback um, Jalen Armour Davis and Kool Aid McKinstry, which will definitely be starting, I believe. He is just killing it uh, in camp and stuff. He's just a beast. We got Malachi Moore in the star position and uh, Brian Branch. Both these guys, phenomenal. Um, both these guys are our are, uh, first round picks. Just saying. Um, future first round pick. I mean, they're just fresh. They're just um, not freshmen. They're sophomore. Um, special teams. We got um, Will Riker. Didn't even miss a field goal last year. 
Field goal blues are gone for Bama fans, and we're so excited for that. Yeah, that pretty much wraps up the depth chart. I cannot express how excited I am for this year. Um, my Crimson Tide, I might even make a prediction video for uh, my Crimson Tide. They're going to go 12 and up. It's not even going to be easy. Get out of there. By the way, <laughs> oh, sorry about that. Um, that's pretty much it, guys. Thank you for watching. X Wing Sports here, checking out. Everybody.